Jamie. We're back at sunny Scottsdale and you've just finished round two of your Tour de Glasgow. Can you explain to us what that is and how your team got on? Yeah, so the Tour de Glasgow is sort of a fun fitness challenge. Well, I don't know if it's quite fun, but a fitness challenge that we do every Friday afternoon in our four clans across the squad. And we're basically split up um, to complete a certain distance on the rower, the walk bike and the ski erg. And it's just a, a team challenge to complete a certain amount of distance between everyone uh, to finish the week off with a, with a good blowout. How did you guys get on? Uh, this week wasn't our best week. I think we finished up a couple of minutes behind everyone else, but nah, it's good. Cool. It's good fun. Uh, and kind of alluded to there, you've just finished week two of a condensed pre-season. What's been different uh, and how tough has training been? Yeah, it's been really tough actually. We've had a couple of good weeks after coming a week off after the Edinburgh Games. But it's been it's been two tough weeks on the pitch and off the pitch, just building towards the new season. Been it's been really good to get to get some fresh some fresh faces in and get some new ideas on the pitch. So we've been working on some some new systems in both the, both sides of the ball in our attack and defence. And it's it's been good to get those out onto the pitch and can already see see how it's going to build nicely into the games. So looking forward to that. And now Rufus has joined us this season and you played with him at school, I believe. Um, so any advice for him for his first season as a pro rugby player? Yeah, I think no, it was really good fun actually playing with Rufus a couple of years ago at school. But um, he's obviously a great athlete and he's, he's rapid. So I think just take his chances when they come on the pitch. And I'm sure it'll be good to see him out, out playing soon. Finally, we've heard there was a forfeit and some of the backs are bringing baking today. What happened and who was the winner of the Glasgow Warriors Great British Bake Off? Yeah, so we've had a, a challenge in the backs these last couple of weeks of a skills challenge split into two teams led by the two Horn brothers and I think at the end of this week we ended the Pete Horn's team ended up a few points ahead. So um, a couple of bakers from George Horn's team had to bring in some goodies for us all. And George himself brought in some some nice chocolate truffles. Um, so, so I reckon they were the best 